Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Aditya 11 Triple T. Today we are going to see how to program SPI ROM flash using SVOD version 1. For this particular programming, you need to understand the pin configuration of SVOD 1. So, what type of pin are required to program a normal SPI flash ROM that is CS MS MIS 0 SIO2 ground this is your MOSI SCL SIO3 VCC this VCC is 3 volt over here you can check it is 3.3 volt or 1.8 volt as per the IC CS is your chip select MISO ground is your ground SI02 and SI03 it is internally connected and pulled high in order to to do the programming it can be pulled low when it is in deep state HCL is your clock MOSI is input pin and this is your output pin okay now you can see over here this is your ground pin over here this is the structure of the SVOD programmer interface here you can see it is a USB power over here you can see it is a USB connection so this is the first pin over here that is your nothing but a ground pin the side pin is your 3.3 volt and last four pin from here from here 1 2 and 3 4 is your this four pin so you have to connect this ground pin to your pin number 4 of the IC so this will be your pin number 4 over here to the IC this 3.3 volt needs to be connected to pin number 8 over here now your CS is your pin number 1 over here MISO is your 2 number pin over here MOSI serial input is your pin number 5 over here and SCL that is your clock pin is 6 number over here now rest remaining this 2 pin pin number 3 and pin number 7 will be pulled to high and connected to 3.3 volt so we have made a simple circuit over here you can see this is your normal chip over here and we have done the configuration using the jumper wire over here now similarly as I have told you over here we have connected this now next what we are going to do is we are going to connect this to the programmer and see its programming now we have done the connection over here and we have placed a 64 that is your 8 MB chip over here to the socket now we will be entering into the interface of the programmer over here this is the interface of the programmer you can see now we will be opening the programmer interface after entering into the programmer interface we have to just select the SPI ROM over here 
as soon as we select SPI room you have to just click on the read ID as soon as you click on the read ID you can see it detects the 64 M bit over here and you can see it shows the Macronics manufacture is over here and the ID code you can see there is no data over here now what we are going to do is we are going to press on the read button over here as soon we click on the read button you can see the reading starts now let me tell you one thing if your connection is not proper this particular reading process will not take place and here you don't have to select the IC number it detects it automatically this is the benefit of this programmer now you can see it has already completed somewhere around 90% and it is going to be completed so here you can see on the hex viewer you can find the data over here so this is the data which is available after reading the chip and this is your <coughs> output available you can see it is all done so you can just save it and this is your bias reading work is over from here so you can save it by whatever name you like and your job will be so all about the SPI reading using SVOD 1 hope you like our channel Aditya 11 Triple T please hit the subscribe button keep on sharing like and comment thanks a lot for watching our channel Aditya 11 Triple T